What's up? Space Monkey here, and welcome back to another Beyond Two Souls chapter. This is part 18 on my end. Uh, this game is actually a very interesting game. Um, I gave it a try, and I've been very impressed with the graphics. Uh, the storyline, you will have to pay attention to the storyline as you play the game, because the timeline, it jumps you around to explain certain uh, parts of this young lady's life. Um, where you can kind of understand a little more of what's going on with her and uh, the connection that she has with a spirit that she's connected to. And uh, you get to control the spirit at certain times and fight off other entities that are trying to attack her. Uh, but this game has been a very interesting game. And as you can see, the graphics are really awesome. And this chapter is called Old Friends. Oh, yeah. Uh, good to see you too, buddy. Walk with me. And this guy here um, pretty much watched uh, Jody grow up. That's the name of the character that you play as. I had no choice. So, she's been through a lot. Have they made any progress on the info world? Something millions into developing a new condenser, the most powerful ever created. Of course, that was only possible once the army got involved. You're working with the army? Oh, Nathan had no choice, really. It's funding on the condition of exploring possible military applications. Go figure. Now, as you can you see, the gameplay the interactions with the gameplay that you have in this game it's not like a lot of games i've played uh honestly it's not at all like any games i've played coming from uh, my background as a uh fps player or a uh, i like to play you know fighting games racing games you know things of that nature uh role playing games so this game has been a very very much of a different experience for me to play. There's no health bar. You know, you don't have like special moves or anything like that in this game. It's basically uh, almost like you're playing and controlling the interactions of uh, this girl in a story. That's basically what it is. In this chapter, we're actually uh, seeking out her mother. We're going to try to find her mother and the connections that we have with her and how we are almost like her or just like her. She had, shouldn't have a problem getting in the facility then. Seeing how uh, we have the abilities to control others also. Let's see if we can uh let's see how we do this. I don't like it, Judy. 
No guard on gate. Empty parking lot. Something doesn't feel right. I'm not back in three minutes. Just come. Girl, I didn't come here to wait in no car. Cole, Cole, wait. And there's other games out here that kind of like this. Uh, I might give them a chance also. Um, just a very different game altogether. I've come to see Nora Gray. Can I see your authorization? Can you help me out? Look, she's my mother. I haven't seen her. Sorry, all visitors must have correct authorization. Another thing in this game, not sure yet, but I think depending on the decisions that you make throughout the entire game will okay, reflect so on the the this. ending of this game. I'm not sure, but I've heard that this game has some alternate endings depending on how you uh, progress through each level. You have it's I mean it's basically it's a your choice thing on here. You can choose to be bad or you can choose to be good. Uh, I have actually played this game based on how I would feel if I'm going through this situation. Founder. Nora Gray, seventh floor, room forty three. Pretty much just to, to control him to get access to this ele elevator. It is kind of weird though. Kind of got the feeling of. What uh, now? I don't know. Find a way to open that door. We're expected to come to this facility. There's anything else in here that we can mess with? Have a look around. Got the power. There we go. We had the option to mess with the uh, screen for the cameras and things over there on the nice computer. Unlock the door. But uh, I think power would be a little more sufficient. Come on. see anything else or any, how, any other way to get in here there's nothing in here we can mess with at, at this moment it's just a big old empty lobby Am I missing something? It's another thing about this game. You kind of have to like figure it out as you go. It really ain't uh, like uh, some games have like little tips that pop up when you get close to certain things and kind of to help you progress through the levels. And this game does not have that. You pretty much have to explore. Kind of forces you to take a second look around 
things and what is that? Huh. I don't see anything on this crazy. I saw that little dot thing up here on the wall, but there's nothing on the wall. I feel like I'm missing something in here. not sure if I walk out in the open past this guard here that he's going to uh, see me no we're missing something because this makes no sense Oh, wait a minute. Oh, he's too far away. Okay. That's how we're going to get in. Looks like they got a worker there that's working the late shift. He's asleep. Aha. See the chairs light up a while ago? We passed them in the lobby there. Okay. Let's see if we can get his attention and make him come in here. Okay, we gotta be a little louder. Come on. That's what we need right there, folks. What he has in his hand. All right, let's take over him. He's getting me up in the door. back to sleep all right we've got the key card Let's go find her mom. It's like a pretty cool looking little garden over there on the right, uh, the left there. Room 43. Let's see what rooms are we at actually. What's the number on this door over here? I'm going to have to take a quick look at these doors. Looks like, uh, 43 might be on the other side of the hallway. 40. 41. Okay. Yeah, it's down in this direction here. Cool. Found it. 
43. I'll wait here. Jody, she may have lost her mind. She might not even know you're there. Maybe you shouldn't go in. What? All this trouble to get here, man? Like she's a camel toastess or something, man. She's like toast. They got her on some kind of drugs. It's making her handicap looks like. So that's where we got it from. The mom. Mother and the father. It's like they were doing tests on her. How important this baby is. She was pregnant. She won't be able to, Nora. Let us take care of everything. It's for the best. You know that. Oh, that's my baby. Bring it back. I've changed my mind. I want my baby. So take it quickly. Okay, the parents that we originally had in the beginning of the game looks like they were uh, fake parents. that all over her mother. Let me get these things off of her. My little girl. My little girl. change that oh man that sucks yeah some of these chapters are a little bit of a, on the emotional side that's sad not sure 
if I'm going to like this chapter because uh, uh, it doesn't look like we can do much for her mother uh, may have to put her out of her misery so to speak I guess Oh man. Really? Oh. Didn't see that coming. I was kind of hoping that that would be some kind of. Man. That's got to be really hard on her. I don't know if I could be able to do that, man. Uh, seek out my mother, find her in a uh, mental institution where she's like spiritually locked down. And the only option I have is to uh, pretty much end the misery for her. Oh. Okay, they expected us to be there. And the government's not real comfortable uh, with us, with our abilities. Where are we at? I figured we'd wake up in some kind of jail cell or something somebody's little office room it looks like they uh, have a lot to do with what's going on it's a nice looking place though some kind of testing facility looks like they've opened a gateway to the spirit world most powerful condenser ever created there he is oh, it's good to see you. we've seen him before I was so afraid something happened to you I've lost weight you look exhausted. But at least you're alive. Let's go into my office. Please, have a seat. How do you feel? <laughs> um, I've been better. That hit on the head did not help. Oh, I'm sorry. I told them not to hurt you. I just didn't want to give you a chance to use either. They find me. I've been tracking you ever since you escaped. They wanted to kill you. But I convinced them to wait. Everybody's always afraid of something they don't know about. Or understand. Where's Cole? He's at home. He's fine. I know he was trying to help you. Don't worry, there won't be any consequences for last night. What happened to my mother? Stable. They were afraid she was a danger to herself and her baby. My mother would never hurt me. 
think I'll take that chance, look. I was a researcher at the DPA, Jody. I didn't discover until much later what happened. Why all the lies, Nathan? Those people pretending to be my parents. The DPA thought you needed a stable emotional environment. A home, loving parents, some semblance of a normal life. Whatever would help us study you in the right conditions. Study me? Wow. Her whole life has me? been fake. As far as uh, was I to you, Nathan? Growing up with those parents. Those lab rat? I was just a girl for fuck's sakes. I was just a little girl. Just imagine how mad you'd be if you found out the your whole life was a lie. In the infra world, you were everything we ever dreamed of. gonna hand me back to the CIA? Is that the plan, Nathan? They brought you here because they have something for you to do, and they'd be very grateful if you do it. Hmm. You're asking me to help the people who wanted to kill me? Is that what you're asking me, Nathan? Listen, Jody... Why should I listen to you? You work for them, and you've lied to me about my mother and my parents, and for what? The money, or the power, or the fame? Oh, stop that, Jody. You know that's not true. I know nothing anymore. We know another country has discovered the infra-world. They think it's something to be controlled or manipulated. They have no idea what they're dealing with. If entities enter our world, do you know what that would mean, Jody? What has hmm. all this got to do with me? Well, once again, this is Space Monkey. This is uh, Beyond Two Souls. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button on the way out. And don't forget to subscribe because there is more content coming in on the way. They want to offer you a deal. And until next time, you do this for them. I'm going to leave you guys with the rest of the video. And uh, we'll see you guys again. Thanks for watching. And peace.